Welcome back, my friends. Ken the Gamer 04. Welcome back to the campaign of Call of Duty Black Ops number two. I can't figure out Menendez without getting inside his fucking head. Salazar, you grew up in Nicaragua. We're just going to skip the cutscenes. I'd rather not go through the cutscene. Ooh, 1986. Showtime, Mason! What'd you see, Woods? Sand. Sand and more fucking sand. Hudson's contact's on his way. You reckon we can trust the Chinese? We can't hear. They've been supporting the Mujahideen, same as us. They know if Russian was in Afghanistan, they'd be looking at China next. No one likes the Russians, huh? You know me. I don't like anyone. Yeah, me neither. You might want to get your head down. Take it easy, Sal. Deliver the weapons. Now, what about your end of the deal? I will take you to the leader of the Mujahideen. He can help you find Raul Menendez. We have fresh horses. We'll follow. Oh shit. Let's do it. Mason, it's Hudson. Did you make contact with Jiao? We're on our way to the Mujahideen camp now. I'm sure I don't need to remind you that our presence here must remain 100% deniable. There will be serious consequences if Russia learns of our involvement in Afghanistan. Yo, that ain't gonna happen. Soviets are about to launch an attack on the camp. Mason, kick it up a gear! Yeah! Yeah! This way. I swear to God, if these poor horses get killed during combat, I'm gonna cry myself to sleep. Like, I swear I will. If a Russian attack is indeed imminent, you're gonna need all the help you can get. I've arranged for a couple of specialists to act in an advisory capacity. Here they are now. Ramon, this is Woods and Mason. My two best men. We need weapons, not soldiers. This should be good. Just so we're clear, we hold off the Russian attack, you give us what you have on Menendez. Our base is here. Any advance will come through one of the narrow passes leading into the valley. I know this. Our men defend these mountains. Our weapons will give them an edge. That's a bullshit plan. They're talking about the Russian army here. They come at you with brute force, which means strength in numbers and heavy armor. Are your men ready for that? They have no experience with the weaponry we brought. And we do. We belong on the front line. God. Yalla! Yalla! Borobiru! You have faith in your plans, America. I got more than faith, Zhao. Let's rock it. We must hurry! We cannot allow them to enter the valley! Settle up, Mason.
be tougher than we thought. We got him dropping infantry right in front of the camp. Please under the move ID. Just get to the two points and hold back the armor. Close! Follow me! He was right behind me. Darn it, dude. What is going on with this guy? He's just gl uh, he's glitched out. fire over there I don't know we'll see Charge set! 
come here and blow that crater charge! Blow it, Mason! Hudson, the West Joe Point is secure. Armor ain't getting through this way. Woods, Mason, they're throwing everything they have at us. We've got threats all over the valley. Hoosier reporting rushing tanks moving in from the north. Brute force and strength in numbers? You expected such a fight. Doesn't mean I wanted it! Gosh dang it. With force and strength in numbers, you expected such a fight. Doesn't mean I wanted it! Is this thing not destroyed yet? Shooting rockets, 
Dead end. That looks like I gotta go way over there then. Fine by me, I'll go over there. I'll teach him who's boss. not abandon the mission. Wasn't I supposed to go here? Yeah, wasn't I supposed to? Oh, because the horse. The horse is abandoning me. Okay. What's going on? Shit! We got another PTR rolling up! Oh, and I died again. So, I gotta go over here. Infantry, fast roping in! Don't let their feet touch the ground! take out the helicopters that would be great if I can just go boom take out take out that helicopter and then can I go ahead and take out those helicopters too and then can I take out that one too Perfect.
Are you kidding me? Why? Why? And then I die again automatically. It's like, come on, guys. Okay. Oh, it's you. I'm like, who's killing me? And then we have a person up there who's just sniping. want to see it though Son of a bitch. Bet your ass he was. Kravchenko basically carved a hole in his head. He sucked those fucking numbers in there, and he survived that. Well, they just didn't see those numbers anymore, but I don't know. I'm not so sure about that. Mason. This isn't over yet. Holy tank. What the hell is the that? Russians want to give us one last display of brute force. Let's give them one last display of courage. You with me? Excuse me? I was trying to escape. You saw that, right? This isn't over yet. The Russians want to give us one last display of brute force. Let's give them one last display of courage. You with me?
Reznov. <laughs> Holy crap. What the fuck? Fucking crap, chunk. Piece of shit. Of course he's involved in all this. Krashenko must die. A couple times, I saw the tick. They get that look in his eyes, they're scanning the room. <laughs> Next thing you know, he's talking to the Russian. Fucking Reznov. <laughs> Good old tricky Vic. Woods. Maybe I should handle this interrogation. If you see the fuck out of my way, I can unfinish business with this bastard. I left you to rot in Vietnam, Sergeant Woods. You should be dead. Nobody told me. Buddy Raman tells me you're doing business with a Nicaraguan named Raul Menendez. What do you do for me? Fuck you. <laughs> you believe in an eye for an eye? Huh? This is a Mujah Dean, baby. They'll bury you up to your neck, peel your eyelids back, and leave you to fry in the desert. I'll take you out quick. Tell me about Menendez. I sent him weapons. That doesn't Must sound die. too Soviet of you, brother. The Soviet Union is dying. Money to do the matters. Where are the weapons go? Cuba. Angola. The third world. Why? Menendez wants to see you and burn. But that's not gonna happen. Oh. <laughs> He's more powerful than you know. He even has people in the CIA. Bullshit! <laughs> this guy's fucking with us. Oh my god. The fuck are you doing? Menendez told me you must suffer. You face piece of shit. <laughs> We have to fight the Russians on your side! No. No, you are and always will be our true enemy. Oh. Gave me that hawk too. Uh. Without water and shelter, you may last a day. If you are strong. So, in a desert buried, the year. Who does your father think rides up on a horse to save us? Tricky Vic. Ha! See? You're just like your old man. No, it wasn't him. That's not. Come on, if you think it was him, don't you think he would have stuck around for a bit, huh? Maybe explain some shit? But what's Reznov doing? That'll do it for this episode. I hope you guys loved it. Please like, comment, and subscribe. I will catch you guys all on Wednesday. Goodbye.